What's going on everybody? Welcome to another episode of Fish and Grubs. We're out here with the Helix 7, first time on the ice. I'm going to show you real quick how to get this thing dialed in to how you want it when you're out on the ice fishing. If you got a Helix 7 or a 5, these are the settings you're going to want on this baby. And we're going to go over that real quick and get you on your way. All right, folks, the first thing we're going to want to do is drop that baby in there. Sensitivity, what do you set your sensitivity at? Water clarity. You gotta jump sometimes hold the hole, different areas of You really don't want to go above like 11 though. Now I'm gonna go to all right. First thing you do is set your depth, right? So with an ice unit, you're going you're not gonna want to run it on auto. Right. Auto depth, you're gonna want to set your depth. That's gonna be your best for what you're doing. So you're gonna to go to your lower range here. You're gonna take it off of auto. You see we're in 18.4 feet. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna click that up to about 20 feet. We're gonna be fishing a basin that has 20 feet or less of water. So by taking this off of auto and putting this in and adjusting your range manually, it's gonna give you a better setup for when you're hole hopping. It's gonna take the graph less time to reset just gonna be a faster more efficient more accurate way so we got the ground set right now at 21 feet. 21 feet yep. and we're in 18 foot of water yep. so that's gonna give you a little bit of the bottom perfect Contrast. there we go now we're starting to see some fish so you just adjusted There's the contrast right down to 10 yep okay sensitivity is at 12 that's not bad there's a fish right there chart speed is at 5 for battery life we're gonna take and turn the... All the way down to five, yep. right? Yep. And we can turn it on night mode as well. It's still plenty of bright during the day. It's gonna extend your battery life tremendously by putting it on night mode and by uh, adjusting your brightness down off of 10. Well, folks, there you have it. And when you get out on the ice, make sure you play around with this thing, play around with the sensitivity, play around with the contrast until you know you're seeing things the right way. But we got ours dialed in about 30 seconds, and it's our first time out on the ice with this thing. So this Helix 7 is pretty dope. Now, again, that special reminder, if you haven't changed over your battery to a lithium ion battery, which I have not yet, and I will be doing, uh, you're gonna definitely wanna change um, you're definitely going to want to change the brightness of your screen to a lower brightness so that this battery lasts more than just four hours. Because from what I've read and what I've heard, uh, this battery at full strength uh, on brightness will only last about four hours. But when you turn it down, it'll last you all nine hours of the day. All right. Thanks for tuning in. This was a quick, short little episode. Again, thanks to Greg from 419 Outdoors taking us out here today. We're up in uh, Rice Lake, Wisconsin, and we're gonna hopefully slay us some panfish. Stay tuned to the next episode when we're actually getting on them. <laughs>